bed. We've been obsessed with this for over a week. Uh, joining us now is Dr. Lear Shiraskin. Is it? Did I say it right? I, I messed it up, didn't I? Yeah. Hey, close enough. Okay. Good morning to you, sir. Okay. So we were looking at the B bed. Uh, which is a bed that you can lay in and you can fall asleep with the bees, correct? Uh, that's correct. Uh, uh, there are three strong beehives under you, and the way the bees produce honey is by fanning their wings to evaporate water and nectar. And when you have three strong beehives uh, inside your bed, they produce so much vibration, they give you a gentle massage at the same time. <laughs> What? Are you serious? <laughs> That's great. And I, I like the idea of this because, quite honestly, uh, Dr. Leo, I, uh, I haven't slept since the Carter administration. I haven't slept more than <laughs> like six hours. So I feel like the vibrations and the sound of the bees would put me right out. Now, you actually offered up these, these uh, specs uh, and blueprints for this thing for free on your website. That's correct. If you go to horizontalhive.com, you can see how it works and build one for yourself. Now, have a lot of people built these, Doctor? Yeah, it's very popular, especially in Eastern Europe and in Russia, where I come from. And, you know, so many of today's diseases come from high level of stress. So what better way of relaxing as having all this vibration of the bees and also they generate so much heat that you will break a sweat like going to a sauna. Are you serious? Yeah, ask them what the temperature that they normally keep. Uh, yeah, Tina wants to know yeah, what's the temperature you normally keep in the bees. Out of our, yeah. yeah, and then you're all surrounded by the smell of uh, honey that they are producing. Mm. It's a quite magic experience. You know, even Winnie the Pooh was saying that eating honey is not the best thing in the world. So I think that sleeping with the bees is. <laughs> and then there are real queens under the covers. That's true. That's a, that's a good point. You have a queen under the cover. Now, uh, we have one of your beds. Uh, you hooked us up with a guy named Dimitri. Unfortunately, they're having severe storms where he is. So what we're going to try to do, doctor, is next week is try to hook up with Dimitri so we can see this in operation and hear the bees. Oh, wonderful. We're very excited. Okay, so if people want to download, oh, by the way, uh, you have lots of different like prototypes and all sorts of things on your website uh, for beekeepers and people who are interested in bees. So give up that website one more time for folks at home. Yeah, horizontalhive.com. This is the kind where all the frames are on the same level, so there is no heavy lifting involved. And I also uh, co-authored a very good introduction to natural beekeeping that uses no pesticides or sugar feeding. That's called keeping bees with a smile. Keeping bees with a smile. We love uh. it. We love it, doctor. Okay, we'll try to hook up with your buddy Dimitri uh, next week and see this bee bed in action. Uh, but we are absolutely fascinated by it. You are one of the happiest dudes we've talked to in a long time. I'm really glad we hooked up. Thanks, doctor. Appreciate it. Bye. Have a good day. That's so great. Where is he at now? Coach? Now he's in Missouri. Oh wow! Originally from Russia, uh, but he's in Missouri. And then we're going to hook up with uh, his friend Dimitri, who has one of the beds, so we can hear it and see it and everything. But oh, it was storming, it. so we couldn't do it today. I